Hello fellow crafters! Is your pen often missing when you feel like writing to your journal? If so, then this pen holder tutorial might be useful for you. Let's start with painting the watercolor flowers. My flowers aren't very fancy, but they will do. Then cut the flowers and choose the flower you like the most. Next step is cutting the cardstock. I am making these cardstock strips 2 cm wide and 20 cm long. Then fold them in the middle and cut them half. And now you can decorate the flowers if you want. Then put the rubber band in the middle of the cardstock strip and mark the sides of the rubber band to the cardstock and make a little cut between the marks and now let's make a loop for the pen and this is a bit tricky but it will be just fine just have a little bit of patience you can make the cardstock a little bit wider so it is easier to work with at this stage. Then cut the rubber band and now you can measure the loop that your favorite pen will fit into it snugly. And then put some PVA glue inside. Glue both rubber bands onto the cardstock and glue the whole thing shut. Before the glue dries, put a paper clip through the hole onto the other side of the rubber band. Then, when it is dry, you can glue the watercolor flower onto it. And then it's done. Yes, and next pen holder I will make with the brad. The process is pretty much the same, except of course for the brad, and I am cutting a longer rubber band for this one. Poke a hole to the flower, then check that the rubber band is in the right place when you make the hole for the brad. 
poke a hole through the cardstock and the rubber band also. Next put the brad through all the holes and then tighten the loop with the pen. and glue the whole thing shut. You don't have to glue the other rubber band to the cardstock because the brat is keeping it in place. Then attach the paper clip and it is ready. Now your pen is always near the journal and you don't have to look for it. Sweet. And now just put it into your journal page like a paper clip and, and it's ready to be used. That's it for today and thank you so much for watching and until next time. Have a lovely week, lovelies. Bye.